Welcome back, boys. Welcome back to episode 14. I believe it's episode 14 of my undisputed boxing career mode. You guys have been asking me to, to get these episodes out faster. I promise I will try, man. It's just been, it's been a minute and there's been a lot going on. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, negotiate for the next fight. Uh, we got Daryl Malik, Bernard Malik. What the heck is all these Maliks they're offering me with 79 overalls? And you've got Sean Porter, which is a title fight. Look at that. Look at that. I guess that's a title fight for Steel City Interactive. Oh, I could win the belt. I could win the Steel City Interactive belt. <laughs> they're offering me a title fight, and that's the fight I'm making the least amount of money for. Now, I could risk trying to negotiate and then the freaking negotiations fall off or I can accept what they're offering me right now and just fight the fight. You know what I mean? And I think that's just what I'm going to do. Um, this one, this particular fight right there, this dude is ranked number seven in the WBC, ranked number seven in the IBF, and ranked number six in the WBO. Y'all see this, man? Wow. Okay. Um. Yeah. Now, Sean is a boxer puncher. Oh, Lord. To be one of the best is my potential for this one. 78 overall. I'm going to accept it. I'll accept it. It says, during your career, there are six titles for you to win. The SCI national title, the SCI continental title, the WBC world title, the WBO world title, the IBF world title, and the SCI world title. Holy crap. Uh, you will fight for the national title between the SCI ranks of 40 and 30. Okay. The continental title between SCI ranks of 25 and 15. The four world titles when ranked between 5 to 1 in the respective organizations. To talent for Undisputed, you will need to be ranked between number 5 and number 1 in all four organizations, making you eligible for all four world titles. So we got to get to either, we got to get to top 5 essentially. Okay. Okay. So, um, media activity, I mean, you know, to, to try to win this fight, I'm not going to negotiate too much on money just because I don't want him to say no. But I would like to have a longer training camp, um, which, as you guys can see right there, reduces how much I make. I'm, I, again, I really don't want to risk this fight falling through just because he says no if I try to negotiate higher. So I'm going to, I'm going to accept what, it, what they're offering me to fight for the title. You know, it's... Uh... Oh, oh, wait, 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 hold on. No, see that that I'm gonna say no to. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna beat you and then give you a chance to. Should I do that though? Nah, nah. And you better accept this, bro. Good. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna beat you and then give you a chance to win your title right back. No, no. That would make me. Uh, okay, so. I've been using this gym right here, which increases all my stats by one point. And the last time, yeah, let's go here. Okay. So, if my energy is low, which is what you guys were telling me, if my energy is low and I try to train some of, I try to do some of these training games, then I might potentially get hurt. So I suppose that's something to try to keep in mind. I've got 10 weeks of training. I don't know how I'm going to really manage this training camp right now because I'm terrible at it, as you guys have already seen. So let's start by doing media and just, just get that out the way because I don't want to have to worry about that. And as you can see, media does not take any energy away from me, but it reduces my fight sharpness and it reduces my weight. I mean, it increases my weight. Because while I'm doing media, I'm not training for a fight, and I am getting fatter, I suppose. So, we're going to start things off with counterpunching. I want to improve my counterpunching a little bit more. Um, actually, is there a way I can... Let me take a look at this guy. Okay, agility, 83. Movement speed, 81. 
jabs, 81, power punching, 78, uppercut, 82. Uh, he has a lot of health and a lot of stamina. <clears throat> Right hand bomb. Inside fighter. And bounce back. Just scouting them. Trying to see who I'm dealing with right here. Okay. Uh, energy, 80. So I'm going to take that opportunity now. To do something about my right, about my my jabs and my straights. Since I have energy, I should not get injured right there. All right, so now I'm sluggish. So now I'm sluggish. And I could potentially get injured if I overdo it. So I'm not going to do that. I'm going to do health regeneration. Now I'm depleted. So now I'm going to recover. And then I'm going to go back and I'm going to do my, where is it? Jabs and straights, because we definitely want to train that. Now I'm sluggish. I'm going to do punch speed, left hand power, stamina recovery. Wait, hold on. That increases my punch and power to 81. All right. I'm going to recover. Gets me to 95. I'm going to train. <clears throat> my jabs and my straights. And then I'm going to recover. And we good. We good. Okay. I'll see if I can remember the pattern that I took with this training. Um, yeah. You guys have clowned me enough. <laughs> Let's go fight. All righty. Marshall Mine versus Sean Porter. Ah, here we go. Here we go. Let's try to get that belt. He's a boxer puncher. So, guys, look. I'm not going to be forcing anything. I'm going to try to just calm myself down and just take my time with this fight. It is going to be 10 rounds of boxing. I don't want to do anything stupid and get knocked out. Um, and I don't want to leave too many openings either. Like, the goal is to win the fight. That's the goal. Win the fight. So, I'm going to look to just hit him as much as I possibly can not get hit by him as much as I can keep myself safe and get that and get that strap this bout is scheduled get for that belt rounds of boxing hiding out of the red corner from the United States of America wearing the white trunks trimmed with green <clears throat> showtime Sean Porter that's not my name. That's not my name. <laughs> that, that is not my name. What are y'all talking about right now? That is definitely not my name. <clears throat> but, hey, we've turned off the commentary. All right. I went over the rules. I want you to protect yourself at all times. And what I say, you must obey. Good luck. Am I actually taller than this guy? How the heck is there somebody I'm taller than? <laughs> like... That is uh, surprising. All right, here we go. <clears throat> he slips it. Very good.
Caught him with that cross. Caught him with the cross again. Nice. Boxer puncher. <clears throat> Caught me to the body right there. Which we definitely don't want that to happen too much. There we go. Catch him clean with the jab. Let's just try to be man. Just take it one round at a time. I've won this first round now. Good. Very good first round. Great first round. We landed more punches than them. Keep it up. Thank you. Nah, he's about to start getting more aggressive. Yeah. Let's just get out the way a little bit. Catch him clean right there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is where they start getting ridiculously aggressive. Ouch. But that's okay. Honestly, the crowd hypes me up a little bit too much. Like, more than I would like. Another one, there we go. Ooh, why is my frame rate dropping? What the hell? I'm not playing anything on my PC. What the hell? What's going on with my frame rate? Oh my God. Ugh. That was a good round, in my opinion. My coach might not agree. Okay. They agree. They agree. Let's see. Looking really good out there. Don't ease off as it could disrupt the rhythm. You're still landing way more than them. Keep this up. Okay. This is round number three. I need to watch the stamina a little bit. This is where they started getting aggressive. I, I always hope for that, like, body shot to, to whiff so I can counter. But sometimes it doesn't. Like, 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 like right there. That's what I mean. I always wish that it would whiff. Too far. <laughs> he 
He whiffs right there. There we go. Catch him with the cross. Woo! I wish I didn't whiff. <clears throat> Another cross. He doubles up on the jab. Oh, that's not good. <clears throat> Decent start to the fight. You managed to drain a bit of their stamina. Uh, he said, hey, look, those traits are starting to take effect. You slip and bam, bro, it doesn't work. I understand that, like, you know, it works boxing-wise, but it, what you're telling me to do... Based on the game mechanics does not work They want me to slip and counter see how slow that is like that doesn't it's not it doesn't flow It doesn't flow the only slip counter that flows is this one That's the only one that flows the slip to the left followed by the left hand the left hook The rest don't See how he how he tried to <clears throat> He is now attacking my body like his life depends on it Oh God. No, watch the head, watch the head, watch the head. Starting to throw these fucking power shots. Whiff that. I can usually tell, like, around around this time, my focus starts to, like, slip a little bit. So, let me just try to bring it back. Try to bring it back. We are landing a lot more punches than them. Start laying in those combos. I don't know if that's a good idea. All right, all right, coach. I, I know I'm supposed to listen to you stuff, but um, I just don't know. This is that's where that's how punches slip in. The only time I'm okay with landing combinations is when I do that. When I hit him with a clean shot and stun, and I stun him. They do this thing sometimes where they just stand still. Like, whew, I cannot believe every single one of those shots whiffed. Even that is not fast enough. Mm. Ten rounds of boxing. This is still round number five.
Okay. It just whiffs, you know. The right, I, I really, I, I really want to throw more of my right hook, but it whiffs, man. Like the, they throw it like high. It's like he throws it high in a weird way, and it just whiffs. <clears throat> it's not, it's not, it's just not landing. Huh? Okay. Too far. Still said, can I ask you guys to please bring back the ability to halt punches by holding block? It would really save me on a lot of like lack of accuracy. Because I sometimes I'll you know start throwing from afar, catch myself, hold block, but then you know the punch still flies. Can we can we please bring that back? When I first tested this game, you could do that. And it, it added so much to the game. It really did. Don't be hugging me, man. I know when you're starting to hug me, it's because you're getting hurt. Oh, Jesus Christ, have mercy. I'm trying to, like, lay in on him a little bit, but... Does Boxer Puncher archetype? That's going to be Canelo, bro. That's what I'm going to have to deal with when I fight Canelo Alvarez. All I hope is that when I reach Canelo, my fighter will be equipped to deal with that man. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> they are starting to tire out a bit, but so am I. And I have won every single round. I wonder if attacking his body too far makes him change strategy. Now you want to hug? Now you want to hug. All this hugging he's doing, I wonder if that means... I wonder if that means he is starting to uh, wilt, maybe? My face is all busted up, but my, my, my health is not too affected.
Watch it, watch it. All this hugging. <clears throat> okay. Okay. I found my shot on the inside, baby. When he gets inside, I found my shot. It is the right uppercut. There we go. Man, I feel like I am doing probably one of the best boxing that I've done in this whole entire series in this championship fight. Oh, okay. Watch my stamina, watch my stamina. He caught me, he caught me. We said we're going to just focus on winning. And that's what we're doing. That man really wants to give me a hug. Stand up! Stand up! One, two, I got hold! Oh no! Okay, so here's what I was saying, man. I'm not, I'm not upset that I got caught freaking teeing off to the body. That's what happens. It should. He caught me with a fucking clean uppercut and slumped me like that. That's okay. I understand. But, man, when you drop and you start pressing to actually start moving like the, the mini game, like it doesn't – you get stuck. So you lose precious seconds, you know? I know I could have stood up right there, but you lose precious seconds because for some reason the thing gets glitched and it doesn't move. Oh my god, that is disappointing, bro. 
That is disappointing, man. Oh, my God. I had it, bro. I had it. I had it. I had it. Oh my god, boys. That is really, really disappointing, bro. That is really disappointing. That is really, really fucking disappointing. But, lesson learned. I'm gonna renew my contract with the coach. I'm gonna try not to, like, get too mad about this, bro. Like, honestly speaking. I'm gonna try not to get too mad about it. Um, My manager, do I have, can I get a new one? Hold on a sec. I was going with Hank. Hank Clark. Yeah, I'm going to stick with Hank. And just do five fights. And... Oh, boy. Well, um... Let's let's move on. Let's not cry over spilt milk. All right, so these are the matches that my manager just offered me. I don't like these matches, and I know that if you don't like the match, you can advance a week to see if you can get something better. So I get a second chance. I get a second chance. <sighs> yes! Yes! Yeah! Yes! Yes! Oh, yes! Yo, I could shed a tear, bruh. I could shed a tear. I could, I, I could, I could actually shed a few tears, brother. I could shed a few tears. We're gonna get a, a chance to do this again. Ugh. That's fine, man. 45K, that's fine. I'm going to accept it. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I thought it, I thought that was it. I thought I wasn't gonna get a chance until maybe next uh, next episode, but I get a chance to redeem myself, and you know, that's exactly what we're gonna do. So, <sighs> thank God, thank God. Okay, um, training XP uh, times three. Increase all stats by a point. How how much is this? A million? I don't. I I ain't got that kind of money. I've already signed up. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. So let's do the media right off the bat. Get that out the way. And then let's do um, let's do my jabs and my straights. Let's get that up. Let's train my jabs and my straights again. I'm, I still have energy. I'm not sluggish. Okay, so now I'm sluggish. So I'm going to do something else, <clears throat> something else like health recovery, for example, or stamina recovery. My, my stamina recovery is okay. Um, yeah, let's go back to health recovery and uh, health regeneration. I did not expect that at all, but... Um, Okay. <clears throat> I'll pay it. I'll I'll pay that. No problem. <sighs> A 
Let me recover. And then we're going to go back to... Look, I'm just going to try not to even get mad at any of this stuff anymore, bro. <clears throat> now I'm sluggish. So then if I'm sluggish... Okay, yoga. I can't imagine I'm going to get injured doing yoga. Okay, like we're not getting injured doing yoga. And then I'm going to recover. I'm going to do a, a, like a big training, like right hand power, uh, straights. I want my straight to. <clears throat> Let me do punching power. Increase my punching power. And then I'm going to recover again. Hopefully. Recovering right now is not going to make me overweight. No, it didn't. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go fight. Okay, here we go. So, pretty much what this means right now is... What this means is that... Like, you really, you really can't get dropped. You genuinely can't get dropped. Because when you get dropped... And, like, you guys might think that I was just making an, an excuse. But I swear to God, I wasn't making an excuse. Like, that's really what happened. Like, if you play this career mode, you would know exactly what I'm talking about. When you, I got dropped, tried to get up, but um, I wasn't able to. So... I'm still going to work his body, but I'm going to be infinitely more care. Like, like, I got straight up reckless in the last round, bro. Like, I thought I had to fight. I lost focus. Son of a bitch. The AI in this game, the AI in this game is not to be, how did I, what do you mean I took a lot of damage? I don't understand. I didn't though. Really? That's how my, that's what my health is looking like right now? Okay guys, all right, all right. Okay. I'm gonna just fight this one. Straight up, like just straight up. Yeah, okay, I see what's happening. We're not taking risks anymore, bro.
If I fumble this second chance, bro, I might genuinely want to quit this career mode, bro. Ah, who am I? Who am I kidding? Who am I kidding? <clears throat> there is no quitting, bro. There is no quitting. No! Woo! Like, my health in this particular... My health in this fight is not as clean as it was in the first one. Like, I'm noticing a bunch of stuff. I'm noticing, like, I'm deteriorating faster. In the first fight, I was solid, bro. I was solid like a rock. That was my round. That was my round, my round, my round. No, 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 no. Jab straight back up. Jab straight. Jab straight, okay? Let me see something. Tracking, tracking me. I'm not going to try to get fancy. I'm not trying to get fancy, bro. <clears throat> trying to get fancy and like mix things up and go to the body and boom, mix it up really well is what fucked me in the first round. And, you know, a little bit of overzealousness for sure. But um, I'm just going to just just find uh, find my win, bro.
Watch the uppercut now. Watch the uppercut now. He gets in, into moments where he gasses himself completely. Okay. Okay. Like, really? Can I please not... This fucking, like, ooh. Like, just don't hold me, man. Don't hold me. Don't hold me with some, like, random knockout or a random drop out of nowhere. Like, can, like... Like, just be fair to me, man. Just be fair. And then and when I get dropped, like, don't get stuck. Like, you, it, like, man, you need, like, a few seconds. They got to fix that, bro. Like, drastically got to fix that. Holy shit. Relax a little bit. He's starting to fight weird now. Where he occasionally will stop and watch me and do nothing. Whenever he starts fighting weird like that, that's when they start getting very dangerous. So here I gotta like just be careful. Yeah, just let him just let him go. Uh-huh, he does that and backs out right away. This is round number six now. Yeah, this is how you, this is coach. This is how you got me all comfortable the last time. They're starting to tire out a little bit. Go get them. Yeah, bro. I am not fucking this one up. I am not fucking this one up. Honestly, hands down the most difficult career mode I've played yet. By far. By far. At this point in, in like any other career that I played, I was already like a fucking monster. Like my fighter was already like just insane. Nobody could fuck with me. Every fight was a guaranteed win. I wasn't afraid. I wasn't nervous about anything. But with Undisputed, bro, like every fight like literally sends me into like fear, like genuine fear. Like, am I going to lose this one? The AI is so good. They're so good. They're so smart. Um... Like, the game has issues for sure, but in terms of, like, the fear of career mode, oh, yeah, this is as good as I've, it's, like, the career mode is bare bones in a lot of ways. There's no training games, and a lot is missing, but in terms of, like, the feel of, like, man, I'm building a career. Like, winning this belt right now, when I win this belt, it is going to give me more joy than any belt I've ever won in career mode, to be honest with you guys right now. 
The only other time that I felt this way was playing uh, the UFC Undisputed career mode. It was the 2000 and 2010 version. Uh, fighting GSP. Beating GSP. Uh, beating GSP's AI. Because, bro, it was so difficult. It was so rough. And becoming champion, I was like, oh, my God. So beating this guy right now, considering he just literally knocked me out the fight before this, it's going to be sweet. I just, I just have to not fuck it up. That's it. I just have to not fuck it up. Like, at this point, bro, at this point, even if he was to win the next three rounds, he's not going to win. I just have to not get knocked down or get knocked out. Like, can I do that? Can I please not fumble this? Can I please not get overzealous? Can I please not get higher myself? Can I please respect him and know that he can put me out and just take it easy one round at a time? Use my best weapons, the shots I'm most comfortable with, and then hope that's undisputed boxing does not flip a coin and he lands a jab and knocks me out you know please please Yeah, that like that cross he, he that yeah that that lunging cross he throws. Relax, relax. No, 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 no. That's what you said last time. That's what you said last time. They are tired and will not. That's what you said last time. No. I'm going to imagine that his energy bar is 100% full and he is angry as a motherfucker. So, no. Okay, I see what's going on. Now you're going to start hugging me and pissing me off and make me want to come get you. And then you're going to land a fucking uppercut and knock my block off. That's what you that's what you did the last time. I mean, that was a comeback of the ages, bro. Yeah, you're throwing uppercuts. I see the uppercuts. No, I'm not going to fall for it. I won't fall for it. Oh, my God. Bruh. No, no, no. That's it. L the rest of this round, I'm just going to coast. Fuck you, bro. Fuck you. Nah. Nah, bruh. 
No. No! No! No, coach. Answer is no. They got nothing in the tank. End this. Absolutely not. I'm not ending nothing. I'm going to freaking fight smart until the referee says it's over. Exactly my point. Hey, it's your fight to lose, bro. That's it. That's it. Mm -mm. Oh, I cannot believe I got it done. There's got to be a graphic of me winning, uh, getting the title. No? That's anticlimactic. Come on. There's nothing. Nothing at all. Look at that. Look at his stamina. This dude still had 51% stamina left, and my coach was telling me he, he was gassed. You see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? This is the sort of bad, terrible advice my coach is giving me. This dude had almost as much stamina as I, as I had, and he's telling me, Oh, it's a, it's a, he's, he's gassed. Look at that. This is the last round. This is the last round. He has nothing left in the tank. Go finish him now. Go unload. Go open yourself up. Boop. Now I'm dead thinking that he's literally about to die. Yo, coach, you're about to get fired, bro. You're about to get absolutely fucking fired for giving me shit advice, bro. I wish there was a graphic of like, you know, of me with the bell, holding the bell, winning the bell, having the bell handed to me somehow, like, you know, they have to have thought about that, you know, like, we got to be able to hold the bell. Come on now. That would be very, very anticlimactic. Don't just show me a belt on the screen and tell me, look, you won this. That's literally what they did, bro. <laughs> oh, man. Well, hopefully in the next career mode, we get, you know, at least me uh, with uh, at least a, a still photo of me with the belt on. That would be, you know what I mean? Fantastic. As opposed to just flashing a belt on the screen. Belt one, United States middleweight national title. Thank you. Unlock the new trait. Plus two, plus one, plus two, okay. A, thank you very much, coach. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. 
Much appreciated. Money issues. It looks like you're running. Yeah, I, I was running out of cash because, you know, I fucking got butchered. You know, that's kind of what happens. A higher tier cut man is now available to hire. A better cut man will improve your ability to recover quickly. Yeah, that would be fucking fantastic. Let's go do that. Find a new cut man. Hold on. This guy was Jeffrey Griffin. All right, Michelle. All right, Michelle. Let's go, Michelle. Sense, give her 35. Look at that, man. I, I used to have way more money than that, man. I used to have way more money than that. But, all right. So my overall drop because I'm fat. I want to see what my actual overall should be right now. So we got 77 overall. Let's train the fight sharpness to 70. And then let me see. I'm, I'm actually kind of curious now who they're going to offer me. A title defense, Cassius Williams. Isn't Cassius Williams someone that I fought before? Cassius, I think I fought you before. I, I, if, I, if I remember correctly, I fought you before. I like that he's a slugger. Which is gonna be very good for me. I'm gonna make thirty-two thousand. Hey, Cassius, listen, listen. I'm the champion. Okay, so it's up to you, bro. I need more money to fight you. We're not. I'm not making thirty-two thousand dollars just to fight you, bro. Like that is not happening. So we're gonna do fifty percent of the fight purse, and I hope that they. I hope they've. They've. I'm not rematching you either. What the fuck is this? I hope that they've done this in a way that as the champion, I get I get a say. And you're not going to like it it would make it wouldn't make sense for him to say no to this. Like this negotiation that I've done right now, it wouldn't make sense for him to say no to it. If he says no to it, that he's absolutely stupid. You're getting a chance to fight for a title. If I tell you that I want a 50% fight purse as the champion, you should be jumping up and down and saying, I agree. So don't say no to this. I'll whoop your ass twice. Yeah, I'll whoop your ass twice. Shh, easy money. I beat you the first time, and uh, I'll beat you again since you want to be you, you, you want to be greedy. Sounds good to me. And also, just in case he f somehow finds a win. <laughs> All right, boys. I'm going to get out of here. Thank you so much for watching this episode. It has been a crazy one. <sighs> Hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Have a good one.